we want to determine four plus three using a number line or determine the sum of four and three. For a view, remember four and three are called addends and the result of the addition is called the sum. To model the sum, we first model four on the number line by starting at zero and moving right four units. Starting at zero, we have one, two, three, four. And then because we have plus three from four, we move right three more units. So four plus one plus two plus three, and we can see the sum is seven. Four plus three equals seven. We can also think of this as four increased by three is seven. Let's look at two more examples. Here we have nine plus seven. We first model nine on the number line by starting at zero and moving right nine units. We need to be careful here because notice how there are labels every two units, but there is a tick mark every one unit. So starting at zero, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's go ahead and make a point here and let's label this nine. And then because we have plus seven from nine, we move seven more units to the right. We have plus one, plus two, plus three, plus four, plus five, plus six, and plus seven. Now we know nine plus seven equals 16. Where again, nine and seven are the addends, 16 is the sum. And then finally we have 12 plus 19. So to model 12, we could start at zero and then jump to 12. But let's keep it consistent and just count by ones. And again, notice how we have labels every five units and tick marks every one unit. So starting at zero, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Let's go ahead and make a point here and label this 12. And then because we have plus 19 from here, we move 19 more units to the right. So plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Notice how this is 31 on the number line, which is the sum. 12 plus 19 equals 31. I hope you found this helpful.